How much screen time should your children be getting? Well, the American Association of Pediatrics came up with some recommendations and they recommend no screen time for children up to the age of two years, up to one hour supervised from the age of two years to five years, and up to two hours from five years onwards. Are your children getting more screen time than that? I'm a physician and let me give you my own interpretation of this guidance. First of all, we have to realize during the pandemic, a lot of work and study is happening on screens. So we can't really be counting schoolwork and homework as screen time. So I would take that out. Secondly, I would even take out watching sports or news on a television from a distance because that is increasing their general knowledge, increasing their awareness of the world around them. I tend to get more concerned about smaller screens, phones and tablets uh, because of its effect on the eyes, on the brain and also I tend to be worried about gaming. So those are the things I would consider in my book as screen time. I consider myself as a pragmatist, not an absolutist. And so my take is that the world is getting technologically more advanced. We are surrounded by screens everywhere. And rather than trying to swim against the tide, we need to understand how to adapt to it and utilize it in a positive and constructive way. First of all, it's very important that your children bite into the rationale for why screen time is being restricted. So talk to them about the fact that there is epidemiological data statistics showing that increasing screen time is associated with more mental health, more suicide, more violent behavior, more obesity, more sedentary lifestyle. This is proven scientifically and the reason we are trying to limit their screen time is in their best interest. They need to buy into this. In our house, we have some simple rules like on holidays, we do not allow any small screens before 2 p.m. or after 9 p.m. No screens allowed on the dinner table. No screens allowed upstairs in the bedrooms. And I believe in being engaged with them in their screen time. So I encourage my children to post educational, creative content, to follow and subscribe to channels which have positive, good content so that they get that kind of a feed and their experience is a positive one.